part two, beloveds. Thank you so much. So I apologize. My screen time went off. So that again is a spiritual practice. And so thank you for rejoining me. I was just sharing with you that my screen time goes off every 15 minutes. And again, for me, that is a spiritual practice because it keeps me off of social media. It reminds me, okay, you've been on social media for 15 minutes, get off. You know what I'm saying? So that's a spiritual practice. And so although I lost, you know, a connection there, I'm so grateful. So I wanted to share with you today's lesson because it just really touched me and I share uh, with my with my tarot you see I got my coffee right here guys this is uh, my morning so all let things are lessons God would have me learn I changed that to goddess so all things are lessons goddess would have me learn it says I will forgive and this will disappear and so I wanted to share with you what that means. What that means is when we let go and we allow ourselves to look beyond what our eyes are seeing, you know, even here in my tarot, it's telling me the same thing. Let all things, you know, this is lesson 193. Let all things, all things are lessons goddess would have me learn. And so I see that here, that my fulfillment is really about letting go, about releasing judgment. And that's what the death card is about. The death card is saying, that is your metamorphosis. Go in, go deeper, you know, stop looking at your feelings and what happened in the past. Boo, hoo, hoo. Those are excess, you know, that's the past. Let it be. That oppression, that oppression has to end. And this is where you gain your insight. You know, and so, you know, I will forgive and this will disappear. And what that means as a spiritual lesson is really just saying, you know, I have been judging myself. I've been judging others. You know, I want to release these negative thoughts. I want to release this negative behavior. I don't know how to do it, but spirit does. And so spirit, please support me. Let me end smoking or being in this bad relationship or drinking or whatever it is. You have to let it go. You really can't keep thinking about it. This is the, um, the, uh, ay, gosh. Oh, here's the book. I forgot the name of it that quick. Vision Quest. Vision Quest Tarot. There it is. Vision Quest. I always keep my little bag and my little book right there. So you guys are seeing this is a, this is what spiritual practice is, you know? This is something that you can see that I'm sharing and supporting not only within what I talk about, but I'm sharing with you how I digest the lesson. And so I want you to go out there today and ask yourself, where are you holding judgment? Who are you judging? Why? Because we don't recognize that it is truly unforgiveness is the, is, the, is the thing that hurts us all. It says here that it is, um, it says the central thought is the same in all of them. These are lessons. Goddess would have us learn. You know, it, it says it doesn't matter what it is. It doesn't matter what it looks like. Let me find where I highlight it. Hold on, hold on. It says, how can you tell when you are seeing wrong or someone else is failing to perceive the lesson he should learn? Does pain seem real? So if you are in pain, then you are seeing, you are, you are seeing falsely. You are seeing through your perception. Hey, Bruja Organica, beloved. So happy to see you. Hopefully you're having a great time over there in Switzerland. So much love to you, sister. I can't wait to get my birthday box from my beloved sister at Bruja Organica. You guys follow her. I love her. And so, yeah, these are the lessons that goddess would have us learn. So when somebody comes to us, they are teaching us a lesson. They are teaching us, wait a minute, am I judging myself? Am I judging them? I will forgive and this will disappear to every apprehension, every care, every form of suffering. Repeat these same words and then hold and then you hold the key that opens heaven's gate and brings the love of goddess, the mother down to earth. 
When we forgive ourselves, beloveds, we can forgive it all. Step into your big self. Look at this is my bookmark by beloved Marianne Williamson. So step into your big selves, beloved. Take a screenshot of that. Happy Friday. I've got to get back into my spiritual practice. Time for my yoga. Go ahead and make sure you guys follow those Yinny Yoga pro, um, previews. I'll be sharing more yoga on Tanya R. Gonzalez. Go ahead and follow me over there. Happy Friday, beloveds. I love you. And uh, forgive, 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 and give it some more. It says right here, give all you can and give a little more. So I love you. Happy Friday. Peace and blessings.